And just in from the Florida Department of Health, people with symptoms of the coronavirus can now be tested right here in Florida. They're reminding folks that no one in our state has tested positive for the virus so far. Our McKenna King is live in Tampa with what this ability to test means for Floridians. McKenna. Isabel, this new ability cutting the time for testing nearly in half. The Florida Department of Health says instead of waiting three to five days for test results, they'll now have them back in 24 to 48 hours. The Florida Department of Health announcing the locations in Florida that will be doing those test it, those tests as Tampa, Miami and Jacksonville Departments of Health. They'll all be receiving test kits for the virus. They say those who should be tested are people who recently traveled to China, South Korea, Iran, Italy or Japan and have symptoms such as fever, cough or shortness of breath, as well as people who have come in contact with a person who had the virus and are now experiencing those symptoms and also people with a fever, cough or shortness of breath that have tested negative for the flu. This is a rapidly evolving situation that we are monitoring very closely. So it is important that we have the capability in a state with many residents and visitors to be able to test for COVID-19. Florida Department of Health says 15 people have tested negative for the virus and four people are awaiting test results. They're currently monitoring nearly 150 people for symptoms, all of whom recently returned from China. Those people are being asked to not have contact with others during the disease's two week incubation period. Now again, the Florida Department of Health emphasizing that no one in the state of Florida is confirmed to have the disease, but they are asking everyone to consistently wash hands and anyone who is feeling sick, they're asking you to stay home. Reporting live in Tampa, McKenna King, ABC Action News.